Independent media around the world are struggling to continue their existence and to remain independent. The changing media market, a decline in trust in media, government interference in the working of media, or attacks on journalists are all affecting the ability of media outlets to conduct independent reporting, to survive and to remain viable. At Free Press Unlimited, we refer to media viability to all that is needed for media to be able to operate and to flourish independently. This includes factors that media outlets can influence themselves, for example, job positions created in the organization or culture that, inno that stimulates innovation, but also factors that outlets cannot influence, like the legal framework or economic conditions in the country and the advertising market. Free Press Limited supports media outlets in providing knowledge and research around media viability. We do this through our online research guide in which various toolkits and resources are presented. It contains a list of accelerators and media labs and studies done around the world. Moreover, Free Press Limited has a special coaching program called the Roadmap for Media Growth, in which media outlets are encouraged and coached into exploring opportunities and innovating within the limitations provided by the context in the country they operate. Together with our local partners, Free Press Limited conducts researches and organizes knowledge exchange projects and meetings to stimulate cross-border learnings. An example of a cross-border learning project is the Vimes project. This project enables cross-Atlantic learning between medium-sized media outlets in Eastern Europe and Central America and provides tools to make the outlets more viable and financially sustainable so that they can remain independent news providers in their respective regions. Examples of studies that Free Press Unlimited has done together with its partners is the research on income models of independent media in difficult contexts and solutions to promote media viability while preserving media independence. Over the past uh, couple of months, Free Press Unlimited conducted several uh, research activities uh, on media viability, uh, particularly one that was funded by UNESCO and co-implemented between Free Press Unlimited and uh, the Economist Intelligence Unit uh, on supporting media viability and it focused specifically uh, on the feasibility of possible solutions to preserve uh, media viability without compromising the editorial independence uh, and the integrity of journalism. In order to do so, we conducted two main activities. Um, the first one was um, a study where FPU attempted, uh, from a practitioner point of view, um, to see how uh, preserving media viability is considered in 10 different countries. And these are Brazil, El Salvador, Indonesia, uh, Jamaica, Lebanon, Namibia, uh, Nigeria, Pakistan, Senegal and Tunisia, finally. Um, and these studies focused uh, on opportunities and challenges uh, for sustainability of independent media. So therefore it focused on income streams and successful models of uh, business models, access to online advertisement, the impact of big tech, uh, and the way that independent media is affected in the context in which they operate. As a second step, as a follow-up to this study, uh, we conducted a series of five knowledge exchange webinars um, that basically brought together media practitioners and successful media initiatives uh, in a way of discussion. VIMES, Viable Independent Media for Empowered Societies in Eastern Europe and Central America, is a project that focuses on supporting small and medium-sized uh, independent media in both regions to engage in collaboration, to create new content, but also to develop new strategies on safety and financial strategies. Uh, this is to support and, and engage with wider circles of society. This will ultimately lead um, to safe spaces for journalists and media outlets to exercise freedom of expression in societies that now have access to independent, trustworthy and diverse information. Um, that is to support sustainability and growth of media outlets while keeping their journalistic mission at heart. For instance, this project enabled testing new audience uh, engagement activities, but also income generation activities, 
or a collaboration and exchange on best practices on production of high-quality journalism.